Yo, what up Street Talks, Eric Kim. So I wanted to share with you a video on why right now is the best time to be a street photographer. So, you know, just some, just some words of encouragement. So right now is essentially your chance, is your opportunity, you know, to quote Eminem, once in a lifetime. So, you know, right now is kind of crazy. It's like, it's really a brave new world with everything and it kind of feels like the wild wild west and i think right now is the best time to be a street photographer there's so much opportunity for us to document all the craziness of what's going around and also part of it is like you know there's still people out in the streets but just like obviously a lot less and now i think street photography is actually more important in today's world um where you're kind of exploring, you're kind of analyzing, you're kind of, you know, critiquing, you're kind of, you know, to, to put yourself in public now is kind of like, in some ways, a, a lot more risky. So obviously, I don't know what the, the laws are in your country or your state or city, whatever, but you know, assuming you're following the law, you know, let's say you go to the grocery store, let's say if you just want to get a walk-in, don't drive your car to the grocery store or walk to the grocery store now that you got a lot more free time. And I'd really say right now the, is the best time to be a street photographer because we're not just like snapping rando pictures for whatever reason. Actually, what we're doing has um, so much a more important meaning where you're essentially kind of documenting history in the, uh, the making. And at least, you know, where I'm speaking here in uh, Providence, Rhode Island, there's still a decent amount of uh, street traffic. There's still a, a decent amount of real life activity. Uh, most people's in cars, it looks like. Not as many people in, you know, walking and stuff like that. But you know, still, you got some people walking. And I think it's definitely a class thing is that rich people are obviously rich enough to drive cars. Poor people who still need to go to work, you know, work as janitors, work at the grocery store. They still got to work. And so, you could also consider this a unique opportunity because, I mean, your city is probably also like a, a ghost town where, you know, there's not as many people on the streets. So yeah, right now could be actually a really unique opportunity for you to talk to people, for you to interact with the city. And even if you live out like more in the suburban areas, you know, maybe you could drive your car to a downtown area, just walk around a little bit and, you know, laws, abiding you could use this chance to actually interact with the city and so yeah i think right now it's it's a currently a brave new world a lot of people are, oh you know when is this gonna things gonna go back to normal my thought is i don't think things will ever go back to normal if anything it's always gonna be a lot more uncertain it's gonna be a lot more chaotic and crazy and you know even this like social distancing six foot rule I think this will actually hold, be held in effect for, for a long time. So I think right now it's just your chance to not only document what's going on, you know, if, if, even if you go to the grocery market and photograph the pandemonium there, you could also use this chance for you to, you know, still like make artworks, still talk to real life peoples and stuff like that. And essentially use your opportunity to uh, explore the world on different terms and you know, I don't know what your situation is, but let's assume you're a tech worker. You know, assuming you don't have to check your email every like five minutes. Right now could kind of be an, a good opportunity for you to essentially just kind of walk around the city, walk around the block, and just kind of get a sense with your own two eyes what's kind of going on. And so even for me, I find it interesting. You still got people walking around and life kind of goes on. And like one thing I've been thinking about a lot too is nowadays kind of life is a little bit more uncertain but yeah there's still lots of cool things you could still see in the city people are still kind of out and about living life and so like even for me personally i'm kind of using this opportunity to you know appreciate my freedom appreciate the fact that i still have the power to go out and walk because yeah like a lot of people you know have to self-quarantine and stuff like that they might not even be able to walk around and talk in public and stuff like that so yeah just kind of think that right now is your chance to to talk to chat to 
explore the city, for it to just kind of get a sense of uh, what's going on. Obviously, you have your wits about you, don't do anything stupid, but yeah, just even if you go, go to the grocery store, shoot street photography there, talk to some real life people, stuff like that. Right now is your golden opportunity street photography. Don't miss it.